All right, everybody. So we all saw the weapon tuning patch that they're going to be releasing along with Lightfall. Obviously, the main note of that entire patch being the little linear nerf that they're going to be doing. And in case you didn't hear about it, well, there you go. So some people might be leaning a little bit more towards getting some good rockets, which have always been good since the galley has been brought back into the game. Even on a few scenarios, they're kind of the main strike to go with. Anyways, my main point being is that Iron Banner is obviously going to be back for the final time before lightfall does drop right and there's actually a pretty solid rocket to go about getting if you do have some time this week to go ahead and play and i am of course referring to getting a roar of the bear now real quick let me show you some of my rolls that i've got personally and by that i mean zero now if you are unlike me and you have gotten the roar of the bear to drop and you're just wondering what the actual perk pool does look like here's a quick look at it right here on screen as you can see there's some pretty good amount of options you got obviously with demo being in the third column that's the one that most of us are looking at here or at least me field prep and tracking are always really good especially because if a rocket misses its target how much damage is it gonna do none because it missed and then the fourth column you obviously have good old vorpal which is just flat 10 percent then auto loading and lasting impression would be your other ideal column for perks me personally the main roles that i'm looking for are going to be demo vorpal with impact casing in column two of course and then maybe like demo and lasting would be a great role to have for those of y'all that do have this rocket let me know your favorite perk combo also keep in mind that compared to the last time iron banner was around the xp gains are going to be significantly increased even more so if you put on an emblem and of course some of the iron banner armor so it should definitely be easier compared to the last time iron banner was around leveling up your actual rank and you know unlocking your rewards right over here let's go ahead and claim my auto rifle real quick whoops <laughs> Life falls drop in less than 26 days, baby. Hell yeah. Also, just a few other things worth mentioning. The ghost mission is the weekly campaign mission for the week. If you're like me and you are starving on those ascendant alloys, bro, that's the spot to head to. And the time to do it is definitely this week. If you run it on master and have good chances of getting one every single run. Also, keep in mind that the blues should definitely be a lot less floating about and around your inventory, the solar system, and your postmaster. Just be wary, though, that there's going to be a little bit more legendaries going around now. So if you got those resources in your Postmaster, I would just check them, bro. Just you don't want to get that shit pushed out. But other than that, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. You guys be safe. Okay.